So Rob is definitely going to be in and out of this. <laughs> That's what he does best. But hi, I'm Paige. I wanted to do a little video of opening mail. I am on a website called ATCs for All. It stands for Artist Trading Card. These are some of mine, and I'll add some close-ups in. They're just two and a half by three and a half inch cards of whatever type of art you make. And you don't have to be a professional artist to be a part of it. You can definitely be an amateur artist or just somebody interested in learning. They're really welcoming and I would be willing to be your first trade if you do want to join. But I have the first batch of cards from the people I've traded with. For some reason it's taking cards a lot longer to get to me than it is my cards to get to them. But the first one I have, I already took this one out of the envelope before I decided to do a video, but um, this one is from Crystal and her name is Bunny Mother on ATCs for All on the website. And she sent me this really cool card. Um, that one's really cool. And then this one is from Sandra and she sent it in this really cool handmade envelope with a, made out of like a, a map. I guess we have to rip it open. She sent me a bigger, like, uh, like abstract painting, um, and it's really cool. And then I guess she cut the end of it off and it says thank you. And then she sent a watercolor of yellow flowers, um, and her name on the website is One Heart. Hers is really cool. It's kind of like a collage. So like even if you can't draw, you can do stuff like this for the website. It's a collage and it has stitching in it, which is why I really liked it. Because if you follow my artwork, you know that I do a lot of hand stitching. This is with a sewing machine. But it also has like a vintage photograph in it. And being a photographer, I was drawn to that. So I really like this card. It's really cool. Okay, this one is from Stephanie. And hers is also in the collage style, uh, and it's over like a like a vintage um, dictionary with a drawing of a tiger by the artist. Her name is Stephanie, but on the website, her screen name is Artsy Like Whoa. Well, oh, hers has a bunch of stuff inside. But she does really cool watercolors with like metallic elements and and maybe pen. Uh, I'm not 100% sure, but it comes out really good. And she sent me one, um, and it's chickens. And then she sent me another one that's a little bit more abstract, but I really like it. It's really cool. And then she also sent me some some stickers and a letter. So it's really cool. Thank you. These are awesome. That's all for now, but I'll be getting these regularly, and if you guys like it, I'll keep making videos of it, because I want to share other people's artwork as well as mine. So I think the, the website's a really cool way to do that, and if you have any interest at all, go make a screaming, you know, make an account, look at the gallery, and like I said, I'd be more than happy to be your first trade if you want to join and you're a little bit nervous. For those of you that follow my art, this is where I'm at right now with this one. 
And for those of you that haven't watched my stories, it's going to have a stencil on it. This is of a horse. Uh, it's going to be bigger than this. This was a test run I did to make sure I like it, but it's part of my Stellarum series. You can see Equus Solaris right here, and it has the constellation up in the top right hand corner. And then we have Canis Major here. And so this one will be Pegasus, the one that I'm working on now. And I want to do another one or maybe more with a similar like galaxy background like this one has. I'm just not sure what other constellations I want to do. I actually went to the zoo the other day to take pictures of animals so that I would have them ready whenever I figure out what I want to do next. But that's all for now. I will see you guys later. Bye.